Evening all, Chief Prepper here. I want to tell a short story and then give a recommendation to everybody. Uh, winter is setting in, so while most of us will huddle in our houses and try and stay warm, I would encourage many of you to spend some time outside. So you may spend more time outside than you want to eventually anyway. So somebody I recently met well, I met him several years ago, but I've started uh, forging a bond and friendship with him in the last few weeks. Um, he tells a story. He was a State Department operator, uh, basically a mercenary, but pick the term. He was in Iraq in the early days of the war. I was too, but I didn't see this kind of stuff. But I did see the aftermath of what we did in the country. When people talk about men becoming monsters and when people talk about how bad things are, this will give you kind of an idea of this story. He says he was out and about and uh, he saw one Iraqi man walk up to another Iraqi man and stab him to death with an electric screwdriver, take the bag that the guy had, little bag or whatever, and take the soda the guy was drinking actually start drinking the soda and walk off so you need to understand when there is not enough resources uh, and if we have a shit shits the van event where there just there is, isn't anything how dangerous it would be one just to be in the area two to have something that somebody else wants keep that in mind so which is why it's always beans, bullets, security, <laughs> and shelter. So, uh, news was not too exciting today, which is a good day for me. So, it is uh, cold here. It's always supposed to be in the 40s again tomorrow. So, yeah, cold weather is here. Finally in Texas. Like a light switch went off. Went from being 80s and 90s in uh, late October, early November to bam, just cold. So I love it, of course. I'm sitting in the living room in shorts and a t shirt. So the fireplace is not going. We will not have a fire in the fireplace until I can get it cleaned. Ordered a tool, supposed to be here. Didn't show up. They said they tried to deliver it at 6.07 p.m. tonight, but I think it's BS. I don't think they ever even came out of the house. Anyway, again, two things. Understand the horrors of war are going to be awful. And uh, start spending some time outside, even if it's cold. You know, go out there and, you know, kind of like when I say time, I'm not talking about five or ten minutes, like spend an hour or so outside. Get your body used to it. So... Anyway, Chief Prepper.